Hello everyone, welcome in Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah with a little bit of a haul. It's a dual haul. We got a little tiny Torrid haul, which we're going to do first because Torrid, home of the fat chicks like me. Um, and then a Mary Maxim haul. Yes, including a mystery bag. Looking forward to that. All right, I've already um, broken into the packages because everything is never proof packaging and we know that. So let's go. Here's the Torrid invoice. Yep. It reminds me of what I bought because I had forgotten. I forgot some of it. I didn't forget all of it. Look at this. Oh my God. Yes. Yes, they're huge. Get over that part. I have big feet. I do. I'm, I'm really tall. So I do have big feet. But these. Look. <laughs> I got sneaks for Pride Month and for every month. Let's be real rainbow and these are always super comfortable when I get them um, from Torrid because Torrid is about the only one that has sneakers like this you know the easy casual ones that'll fit me they come in a 13 so there you go oh my gosh I cannot wear I cannot wait to wear these these are so stinking cute yes so I did get those I'm gonna set everything up here for a minute and then I'll have to toss it all back in the box because I'm in the dining room and there's no room for this what else did I get? <clears throat> I think this is the top. Oh, and by the way, the sneaks. I had a coupon and stuff, of course. Um, the sneaks were $37.53. Okay. Yeah, that's a bit more than I would normally spend on a pair of sneakers like that. But it's for Pride Month. And they had part of the proceeds going to something good. So I'm all about that. I apologize for the crinkle if you're hearing any of that. But, oh, silica gel packet. Don't eat that. Okay. This is just a tank top. Um, I love the floral print on it. This is something I can wear for work, you know, because waist up and all of that. It has buttons on a placket. But these buttons actually do unbutton, but then it stops right there. So, super cute, super cute. The price on the tag is $45.50. Oh my goodness, let's see. This for me was $25.94. Yeah, it was on sale because of course it was. I think it was actually on clearance. It may have been on clearance, I don't know. Well, it's even got a little pocket right there, but I love the floral. I mean, I wear florals a lot. You'll see me a lot in florals because I like them. They're flowery, they're pretty, they're happy. Gotta have the happy. And this is my birthday month, so I did decide to treat myself a little bit with the Torrid. I do keep it all paid off though because I'm not a monster. But I do need to go through my closet and get rid of some stuff. Yeah, the closet is getting overloaded again. And by get rid of, I don't throw things away. I gather stuff up and donate because I just can't bear to throw things away. I have been that person without stuff before and to be able to pick it up cheap someplace is great. This is a skirt. It goes all swirly swirly because the bottom is super big. This is gray, maybe not so appropriate for summertime unless you pair it with something a little bit brighter but it has like some elastic -y stuff in the waist, but it's not full on elastic. So you can get it up there, but it's still comfortable. Oh, y'all, it has pockets. Mm-hmm, yep, gotta love the pockets. All right, original price on this sucker was $59.50. Y'all know me better than that. Uh, this was $8.53. Yes, it was. And I think I only added the uh, the tank top to make things um, cheaper to ship or so. I don't remember why I added it. It was like, oh, that's cute, even though it was a little higher than I would normally spend, even, even though it was a deal. Okay, the most important thing that I got, the thing that made me super, super happy. First of all, look at that happy print. You will see it in more detail in a minute. Uh, this was not on sale. <laughs> I know, right? It's rare that I buy something not on sale. But they did have like a buy one, get one, something off and all that stuff. I can never understand the, the math of it all. Okay. 
Look at this super cute dress. It's got like a halter neck, very open. This is my dress for Pride Month. It's got all the stuff about equality, I am an ally, peace, love, be you boo. It is all over it. I am all about Pride Month and I am definitely an ally. This I absolutely love, okay? It says 65.50 on the tag. Yeah, it was $62.22 on here. So there was a teeny bit of a discount, but not much on this. But I don't even know if this one has pockets. I don't think it does, but I don't even care. It is so stinking happy. That print is everything. I love it. So I cannot wait to wear this. I've got to get it in the wash so I can wear it. And yes, I wash new things before I wear them. If you have uh, ever worked at a factory before, a clothing factory, you know. I have worked at clothing factories before. It's not the fault of the factories, but fabric sometimes has yucky things when it gets shipped in. So you definitely want to uh, wash stuff before you wear it. Besides the chemicals and sizing that are in the fabric. Just, you know, word to the wise. I always wash my stuff before I wear it. Unless something absolutely like, you know, you rip a pair of pants or, you know, you've stained your shirt. You've just got to go pick one up quickly and put it on and go someplace. That's different. That's like emergency situation. But just in general. Okay, putting this box over here so that I have room for Mary Maxim. I know y'all want the yarn. It is all about the yarn, isn't it? I don't know how I'm going to do this, but we're going to try. All right. And by the way, this is a big box. Okay. I did open the top. I ordered some stuff, and I think I did some stuff just to kind of get up to the free shipping or reduced shipping or something because it's what I do. But I want, ooh, I want all the things on here. They always send flyers and stuff. Oh, wow. $5 off any $10 order or more. They've got jigsaw puzzles on here. Look at the kitties with the yarn and a throw kit and a national parks coloring book and some religious felt calendar this cute spring gnomes thing with plastic canvas see mary maxim has a lot of different crafts uh, this tote is really nice look at that that's pretty blue and the persian tiles throw oh my gosh on the hook uh, crochet with jean she's making one of these in a different color but Oh, this is the light blue it says it's marked down from 80 bucks to 70 bucks basically the Persian tiles throw if you were looking to get that it is on a little bit of a sale I do have the invoice here um I had I think get 20 AC I, don't, I think it was 20% off I don't remember but the yarn mystery box um, was definitely on sale Okay, I gotta figure out how to get in here. I know I didn't order that. That must be part of the mystery box. And I ordered that. Oh, good gravy. I don't even remember what's in here. Oh, I did order, okay. <laughs> A one pound bag of yarn, solids. And I got this sort of, maybe not corn, beigey, very neutral, kind of yarn so this is my pound mystery pack it doesn't tell you what it is it could be a Caron one pounder you never know and it's all good I got a pound of yarn you could definitely make use of it I ordered these little guys uh, Lion Brands Vanna's Choice and Rose Mist I ordered two of them because I thought the color was pretty oh the pound of yarn by the way was $4.79 not bad okay this Vanna's Choice. Now Vanna's Choice is a decent yarn. This is acrylic, 100% acrylic. It is, where'd it go? Uh, 85 grams, 133 meters. It's a four weight. Yeah, that's a nice four weight there. And this color is Rose Mist. And these were $1.59 each. Yeah, $1.59. That's really a good price for this. And that's a nice pretty color. I could see even if I did nothing with it for myself, that would make some a couple of awesome hats uh, for donation that somebody would be happy to wear 
in a nice pinky color. Did I get two of these? Oh, I did get two bags of... My other pound of yarn is a beautiful dark blue. Okay. See, I forget what I order. I order stuff, and it's like, what did I order? I have no flipping clue. Hello. But, yeah, I look at the invoice, and I've realized how the invoice is written now. Hello. Um, pound of yarn. Solids. It, it, it's acrylic. It's 100% acrylic, I'm sure. And it looks like it's a four-way. So, like I said, probably a Caron one-pounder or something like that. And that is a nice dark blue color. And that's a lot of yardage. Nothing wrong with these. You know, it could be a mill end. It could be whatever. But no no label, no tag. And that's okay. I'm going to put this over here in my shoe with my, with my torrid stuff so that I have room for this. For one thing, bonus, big old storage bag. Okay, I'm loving that. Wow. Oh, and I got patterns in here too. What? Okay. Let's see what they have put in this random bag. Yarn mystery box. They call it a box, but it's a bag. They should just call it a bag, but whatever. Um, $24. $24 for all of that. Now, I know that's that's a good deal already, no matter what's in here. Oh, wow. Wow. Hang on. Holy cannoli, y'all. Ooh, I got enough of like bunches of same stuff to like, it's not just random. Look at this. Look at this, okay? Three of these red heart bunches of hugs. They're 14 ounces. They're almost a pound. Um, nine, 948 yards, 868 meters. The color that I have received is is what capri oh that is super pretty let me take one out of plastic so we can see the color up close and personal because i know i know i want to of these bags they put them in too you don't really have to rip them they just unseal i like that because you can just put it back in the bag right look at that that is such a pretty color okay wow i like this i like this a lot it's red heart i've never had red heart bunches of hugs 100% acrylic, duh, all right. It's so a medium four weight, yep. It's not a super thick four, and if you give it a little bit of a stretch, it kind of thins out, but it's a four weight. Machine wash cold, gentle cycle, tumble dry low, do not iron, do not bleach, hello. Professionally dry clean. I've never dry cleaned anything in my life. They can get over that. Um, yeah, I'm kind of jazzed with this. That is super nice, and it's made in Turkey, and is it super soft, like, you know, like, ooh, alpaca or whatever? No. It's not scratchy, though. It is softer than, like, your normal dark-colored Super Savers, because the dark-colored Super Savers do tend to be a little rougher than the lighter-colored ones, believe it or not. All right, I'm already jazzed about this. Three humongous balls of that. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold your horses. Make sure there's no more in here. Four. Four of these bunches of hugs. Y'all, I got blue yarn out the wazoo at this point, and I'm kind of digging it because that is such a pretty color. Oh my gosh, that is so happy. Yay. All right, yay. <laughs> Wow. Okay. <laughs> this, I don't know if there's only one. There might be only one. Okay. That's kind of weird that they have bunches of that and just one of this. <gasps> oh, but it's so soft. Oh my gosh. Premier Retro Velvet Grand. Grand, it says. The color is steel. It's a jumbo seven. I just want to squish it. Oh my gosh, it's a shame there's not squish a vision, okay? Because it is so squishy and soft. Oh my gosh. I don't know what I can do with one ball of this because it is um, 200 grams, 40 meters. It is 40 meters in this one thing. But I have other yarns, something like this, that I could probably put it with and make something a little small with it. But oh, oh my God, that is so soft. So soft. I love it. 
Now I have some stuff that I'm a little confused about. I have like a metric boatload of croquettes. Hang on. They're all piled in here. Ugh, there's so many of them. I didn't expect there to be this much yarn in this, quite honestly. A lot of mystery boxes you get, you know, you're going to cook. Well, it's usually a lot more money, too. It's usually about 40 bucks, I think. So, yeah, there was a discount. Okay, this is not the end of it, either. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I have eight of these croquettes. Wow. These are... Are they all a one weight? Wow, they are a one weight. 45 grams, 219 meters in each one, and I've got a couple of different colors, I believe. This one, even the print is small, good grief. 92% cotton, 3% polyester, 3% other fibers. I always wonder what other fibers they are. It's like, you know, alien back hair or something. What is it? Tell me. Oh, this one is called Revenge. Get revenge on your enemies by crocheting with this tiny stuff. Or something. It looks like I have four of these and four of this color. Let me just slip this off. It's a cute little cake, though. Put that back on. I don't want it to go away here. Uh, of titanium. Y'all, what do you make with this one weight croquette stuff? Tell me. You must tell me. Because, wow, I got a lot of it. I got a lot of it, okay? But wait, there's more. Channeling Billy Mays there for a second. Remember when I told you I had a metric buttload or a metric boatload, either way you want to look at it, of blue yarn? Well, I do, because here's some more. I have never, ooh, I've never had any of this. Let me get in there. Let me get in there. Two balls of Fair Isle. Okay, it feels like wool. What is it? It definitely feels like wool. Tell me. Yeah, ooh, ooh, 100% super wash wool made in China. It is Fair Isle Kodiak, a four medium, says to use a five millimeter hook, blah, 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 machine wash, warm, gentle, do not bleach, dry flat, do not iron, and the color appears to be celestial. I hate when they have a little bit of their sticker going onto the yarn. I gotta fix that. I tuck it under because I don't want it sticking to stuff, okay? That is a gorgeous freaking color. I don't know what I'm going to do. Oh, it's beautiful. It's, it's a wool. I mean, it's not like super scratchy, but it definitely feels wool. Smells nothing. Wow. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm staring at the yarn. I just adore this color. That is stinking beautiful. Okay. Two balls of that. There's more. There really is. I love mystery boxes. Three, four, five, six. Oh, I forgot they're having a, a thing too. Wow, there's, every time I pick something up, there's more. Okay. I have six of these. That looks genuinely black. Let's see what it is. Bell Day Home, 50 grams, 200 meters, 100% acrylic. Okay. Lot 30, a uh, lot 2336, color 30. Doesn't say anything to me. A lot of is in another language. The price on it is in euros. 1.99 euros. I'm not sure how you would say that. Is it 1.99 euros or do you say like 1 euro 99 cent to euros? I don't know. I don't know. But it's that's what the original price was. Um, all right. 
there's a good bit there. That is a nice, I love the twist on that, that yarn. You can see the twist when you're looking at it like that. It's not a light gray like that. That's just my uh, ring light shining on it, uh, making it look like that. This is actually more the real color back here. Wow, wow. All right, I am digging it totally. Patterns, um, crochet ripple scarf, okay. Oh, summer breeze top. Nice, I don't know what it says. Extra small to 4XL, so I'm on board with that too. That's weird. It's upside down in there. Okay. You're supposed to use a sport weight. Whatever. I don't even. I don't even pay attention to that stuff anymore. I just kind of, you know, measure it and see what happens. These are some cute things: finger puppets or lollipop covers. That's cute. A little Christmas deal there. Waffle stitch tea towel. See, if I print out, my patterns are all in black and white because I don't have a color printer. We just have like a little laser printer. So this is kind of cool. And it says, level beginner. Of course, for a tea towel, it had to be cotton. None of this is cotton, but I do have cotton in my stash. So yes. All right, that'll do. That's awesome. That's pretty. This is a knitting thing though. So this may have to go to somebody who knits, but that is a pretty, pretty blanket. Patents or Peyton's Canadiana, the cable wave blanket to knit. So yes, all my knitters out there, somebody will end up with this. I will definitely pass it along. Well, holy cannoli. I think that's finally the end of that bag. I put the black back in there because I was like running out of room. Um, Wow. Now I gotta figure out where to put all this. That's the hard part. I have so much yarn. But all you people that keep showing this really cool stuff, like I learned about this from, of course, Crystal Bag a Day because she's like nuts about um, mystery bags. And I understand, I get it. And they're doing with uh, Mary Maxim, I don't know how long they're doing this, they're doing a mystery yarn box kind of thing. If you buy something, you get a number. Okay, save this till I forget when. Here we go. Thanks, fellow Yarniac, for helping us rescue our favorite fibers. We're showing our appreciation with a fun giveaway. Each mystery yarn box sold for the month of June has this special card included with a unique number. Make sure to keep it safe. At the end of the month, we will draw a number and the yarn rescuer who has that numbered card in their mystery box will receive a $100 gift card to MaryMaxim.com. Make sure to follow us on our social media and use the hashtag ShareWithMary on your yarn haul posts. I'll be putting it on this. You better believe it. And I'll stick it on Insta too as well because I am number 108. I think that's very cool to not lose that. And again, I do have to find a place to put this. Yeah, that's going to be tough. Anyway, I need to wrap this up and actually put this stuff away, get this uploaded and all of that stuff and uh, not have any lunch because it's my lunchtime and I think my timer's about to go off. So uh, there is that. <laughs> I am off the entire week of June the 15th because June the 15th is my birthday. Be sure and join me. There will be a live on the 15th early in the morning at 9 a.m. Eastern. Um, there will be giveaways, special guests, um, just lots of stuff. There's giveaways all week long, actually. Lots of giveaways. So be sure you stay tuned for that if you're watching this during this time. If you're watching this much later, that's over and I'm sorry you missed it. But, you know, watch anyway. <laughs> Love y'all. See you very soon. Bye now.